Okay, what's going on with the sign of Capricorn? Capricorn. Okay. Okay, I see you stepping out of your comfort zone. There's going to be a friend that's going to enter your life here that's going to help you step out of your comfort zone. Could be dealing with a Leo or a Virgo. But you have one foot in and one foot out of this situation. Could be dealing with a Sagittarius. And I see you coming back around from being left out in the cold. But you're being treated unfairly because the situation is coming to an end. <clears throat> but you feel hurt, you feel betrayed, and you feel stabbed in the back here. So I see you holding back and saving some money. You're guarding your heart. Because somebody here is not willing to put in the work. Somebody here is not willing to be a team player. They're not willing to put in the effort on building a solid foundation. So you're not investing into this anymore. You could be dealing with a father, a boss type individual, but somebody's making plans to get together and this person's not showing up and you're being treated unfairly. Could be dealing with a Leo, Virgo, Sagittarius, Libra, or an Aries. Yeah, this person's making plans to get together and not showing up and you're unable and unwilling to make a decision. And this is causing you to feel insecure. There could be some kind of jealousy issues. You could be giving up because of a third party situation. You could be giving up here because somebody doesn't have the confidence that they need to have to take action. And you want to come out of this depression. And you are. But you have one foot in and one foot out of this situation. So I see you standing your ground because you feel hurt, you feel betrayed, and you feel stabbed in the back, and the situation is over. Could be dealing with a mother, a Libra, or a Taurus. But you're trying to stand your ground here. Some of you could be traveling to someone's home here. Because somebody's not willing to put in the work. And they're not telling you the truth. So this is causing you to be unable and unwilling to make a decision because this person's not telling you the truth. And they're not willing to put in the work. And this is going to cause you to have a life-changing experience. Some of you are going to have an unexpected bill because this person's not telling you the truth. But this is going to be very unexpected and life-changing. You may receive an apology or someone may apologize to you. Yeah, somebody may apologize to you or you may be apologizing to someone else here. But somebody is going to come forward and express how they feel. But you're moving on. Some of you are going to be taking a trip. Some of you could be going on vacation and taking a trip. And some of you are going to need to take a break from this. <clears throat> but you're moving on. And you're trying to be kind or understanding about this situation. You could be dealing with a Virgo. Some of you could be taking a trip to see a Virgo. A Pisces. But you're stressed out. Because you're heartbroken.
so you're making a decision here to end some kind of partnership or contract here because you're stressed out about this and you're having a lot of sleepless nights and you're trying to be kind or understanding about this there's an invitation to a social event here and somebody's not showing up so you're making a decision to end this partnership or contract here because there's conflict this person's emotionally unavailable And this relationship is not growing closer. Could be dealing with a Scorpio. And there's a delay in communication. So I see you getting counseled on this. You're going to have to balance out your mental and emotional considerations. Could be dealing with the Libra. Yeah, you're getting counseled on this. So I see you buckling down and getting things done and honoring your commitment. Some of you are getting counseled on social media. be dealing with another Capricorn okay and some of you are getting counseled about a situation online on social media, I see you getting the work done. You're buckling down. You're getting things done. You're honoring your commitments. But somebody's ego could be getting in the way. Could be dealing with the Capricorn. And there's a new person that stirs up your romantic feelings. You may be dealing with another Capricorn or a Leo. This is going to happen on a rainy day. Some of you could be getting a new home because of a storm. But there's going to be some bad weather on this day. And there's a new person that stirs up your romantic feelings. There could be the resurgence of a relationship. And some of you are going to get news of the birth of a baby. It's going to be on a rainy day. But there is a new person that stirs up your romantic feelings. There's going to be the resurgence of a relationship here. And I see you closing out some cycles. Because you're sad. And because a new person stirring up your romantic feelings. Yeah, you're closing out some cycles and you're walking away from this. Could be dealing with a Leo, Scorpio, Taurus, or an Aquarius, but I see you walking away. I see you walking away to spend time with family. And you're happy. I see you doing some kind of charity work here. This could be for family. Could be coming into union with somebody, a family member, and doing some kind of charity work here because you're walking away from a situation. You're walking away into a union, and this is going to make you very happy in a family situation or a relationship. And this is why you're doing some kind of charity work here. <laughs> This could be doing some kind of charity work at a house, on some kind of property. All of your emotional and material needs are being met. Because somebody's not willing to put in the work here, so an offer that was made fell through.
So I see you discussing some kind of plans. I see you turning your back on this because this offer that was made fell through. I see you taking action. Could be dealing with a Sagittarius, a Cancer, or an Aries. And you are ready. You have all the resources and the materials that you need to have to manifest whatever it is that you want. Could be done with a Virgo and a Gemini. Aries, Sagittarius. You're ready, Capricorn, but you're having anxiety about this because you have a lot of options and you're confused. But you're feeling stuck. It's a temporary delay, Capricorn. You're having anxiety because it's making you feel stuck and there's a delay here. And you're trying to heal from this. Because somebody's not telling you the truth. But you're keeping it to yourself. You're listening to your intuition. Could be dealing with somebody with the letters of B or J. Could be dealing with the Pisces. Or a psychic, or this could be you. And you're trying to heal from this because somebody's playing mind games. And you're heartbroken about this. Because this person's wanting to win here at all costs. This person's emotionally unavailable. There could be some kind of overindulgence in food, drink, or alcohol here. I see you getting out of the house to do some kind of coaching or mentoring on this. You could be mentoring someone here about overindulgence in food, drink, or alcohol. They could be overindulging in food, drink, or alcohol and you could be getting some kind of mentoring on this or coaching by somebody that's within your community or your spiritual tribe, your like-minded friends or community. <clears throat> could be done with a Virgo or a Taurus. But you don't have the same values as this person. This person's emotionally unavailable. They overindulge in food, drink, or alcohol. You're getting coaching or mentoring on this because you don't have the same values as this person. And a situation is coming to an end. Because you're, lo you're losing faith in this. So I see you collaborating with somebody here that's willing to put in the work. Could be dealing with a Taurus, a Scorpio, a Virgo. But you feel like you're wasting your time. Because you're not getting the attention or the recognition that you deserve. And this is causing an upset in your home environment here. So you're making a decision to end some kind of partnership or contract here. Because you're not healing from a situation. Could be dealing with an Aquarius. Some of you are stars and you're not on the right path. But there is a new romantic opportunity here, but you're not healing from this. So you're not waiting around. There is a new romantic opportunity. Some of you are going to be discussing some kind of new business ideas. And there's going to be some back and forth communication about this new opportunity and romance. But you have your walls up here and you're trying to protect what it is that you've created. <clears throat> some of you have an ex-lover that's returning. This person's telling you the truth. But I see you getting to the truth of the matter. You're getting more information because you're trying to protect what it is that you've created. And there is a new start here. 
I see you waiting on the arrival of someone. And you're moving forward victoriously here, but you're doubting yourself because there's some kind of conflict here. So you're deciding that it's not too much work. You're having some kind of stress-related health concerns. But you're deciding that it's not too much work. Because there's conflict. And you see this as a burden. There's too much competition. And bothersome details. And this has been weighing heavy on your chest. And you see this as a burden. And there's an opportunity that's being missed. This could be online, on camera, or over the phone. Could be done with another Capricorn. And somebody's having bad health because a relationship or a contract ended. So I see you cutting out the things that don't serve you. You're making clear and objective decisions. And you're paying attention to the red flags. You could be dealing with another Capricorn, a Gemini, and a Gemini. But y'all, you're going to start cutting out the things that don't serve you here because this could be causing arguments. And somebody got caught lying, cheating, or stealing. And things, things are about to turn into your favor, Capricorn. Luck is on your side. Could be dealing with the Leo, Taurus, Scorpio, or an Aquarius. Some of you are getting sudden wealth because things are about to turn into your favor. But I see you living in life's little luxuries, but you're having bad memories from the past here about you getting all this money. And how things are turning into your favor. And how this person got caught. And the arguments it caused over the money. So I see you cutting out the things that don't serve you here. And some kind of secrets or deceptions being revealed. And you're having bad memories from the past. Could be dealing with a cancer. And you feel rejected. Because it's causing conflict and things are not moving forward. Yeah, you could definitely be dealing with a cancer. But somebody's losing control over this situation. And things are not moving forward. Could be a breakdown involving a vehicle and I see somebody that's going to come rushing in here. Some of you are exhausted and some of you need to take a break. Because it's making you feel stuck. Some of you could be having problems with electronics or appliances and that could be why a vehicle is not starting. Or that could be why the vehicle is broken down. But you need to take a break here because this is making you feel stuck. You need to take a rest. Some of you are going on vacation, but some of you need to take a break because it's making you feel stuck and somebody's going to come rushing in here. But this person's being stubborn. This person's non-committal to their work or their relationships. You could be dealing with a Taurus. I see you getting gifts of money for your time and effort. Because a decision was made against someone here and somebody's deciding not to change jobs or not to change locations. What's going on with Capricorn? Okay. Wow. 
Okay, coming up soon, Capricorn. I see you getting sudden wealth. And it's going to be a great fortune. The Capricorn, you're having bad memories from the past, the last time you got this money. This is concerning a contract. Somebody's going to have to make a choice between two things because you're very stressed out about this. Yeah. And this is going to be held in high honor. So this is, this is definitely official. I got goosebumps, so something good's about to happen to the Capricorns. Yeah, this is involving the family room of a house, and this is going to be held in high honor, and somebody's stressing out about this. But you are getting sudden wealth, and it is a great fortune. Oh my God. Because somebody's being a thief? Okay, and this is involving a courthouse, and somebody's feeling stuck in a situation. Somebody could be going to jail for not for being a thief. And this is in the family room of a house. This is involving a police officer or a lawyer. Anybody that holds an official type position Capricorn Okay Capricorn Whatever it is you're going to have to get more information because the answer is yes the situation will improve, but right now it's unlikely. So you're going to have to reconsider. Sit on this and meditate, Capricorn, because it's not the right time. We have a thief in the picture, but the answer will be yes. It's just not the right time. The answer is no right now. It's not the right time. You have to meditate first, and then the answer will come to you, but you have to reconsider. Because whatever you're going through right here, it's unlikely. But this situation will improve. You just have to get more information. Good luck. 